going to unbox for the first time is the cold sparklers, okay? Cold sparkler machine. Just for that uh, effect, they use this. Um, I first noticed it in uh, WrestleMania, wrestlings, and then weddings, and then music, music events, awards, performances. And now 360 photo boots. Um, now use it for the, <laughs> you know, and that's basically, besides renting it out, that's basically what I'm gonna be using it for. Okay, so first thing first, comes with, a, there's a remote in here, and a manual. So let's get this cable, and, Grab this. Brand new. Soon. The cables. I think it's DMX and the power cable. And the unit itself. Let's get it out. This these are the 700 watts. Let me show you how they look close up. There we go. Okay. This is where you the, the sparks comes out from. And this is where you put in your granular or your <laughs> powder, which is uh, it looks really shiny in there. Okay. A spray nozzle and then powder inlet. Okay. So it's connection time. Let's take a look at the connection. Come close again. So this is the connection. See everything? Okay. So we're gonna input on this three cables, one power, and uh, they are power color coded. So that's the good thing. Um, so this will definitely be the one to come in the blue. Yeah, we're going to connect them together, the AZ chain, as, as it's called, um, so that one control will, will um, one remote will control both units. All right, that's the click sound. No, we don't. So we're going to power this one now. I got my station here. Plug it in. Um, have I decided which is going to be the lead? So maybe we should power one on first. Where do we have LED light? Back here, so we'll face the camera on this side. So let me open one of the remotes. Let me open this one. It has a fuse. So let me see if the battery is ready to go. Oh, I have to install the batteries first. Okay, I have to install the battery. So, tiny little battery comes. in here and good luck we should have power now um yeah you might want to raise the antenna just for better reception um, so i see i see color so i know it's working this is the granula it comes in different sizes but this is the only one i could get for now okay um if you keep them too in a cold place, they become solid blocks and you can't use them. So this is, uh, I learned out the hard way. You turn into the holes, the hole I showed you where I took off the cap and heat it up. That's what you're supposed to do. But for now, I want to turn on power and see that all is well. So we turn on the power and we see. And I turn that on. So we have power on both. Okay, and both set to A A1, A001. Alright, so let's put the granular. Try and make sure it doesn't go into the other hole. You don't need too much. Just pour it a little. Maybe we can pour on a sheet of paper and then do that to that. Just to be on the safe side, I'm gonna use this. 
one of it as small as possible. That's good. When you leave these things in there, they bowl up and become rocks or stones in there. So you need to either use them up completely or get them out, whatever is left over. Cover it up, don't forget to do that. Dust everything up. I will power this on. It's just on. Um, from what I know, A will start heating it up. So I'll press A now. Um, but I don't see that heating up. Okay. It's supposed to heat up to 500 before you can use it. But I don't see that heating up. Let me see. Okay, so let us stop. Let's not forget we need to pour out the, the uh, powders from this one. Too heavy. Let's pour it out. Now we can put this away. That doesn't look like it's charging. Okay. So we started late. Thought we were already charging. Go! Takes few seconds. I think we used up everything, so we are good. So we're gonna let it turn up. So we're gonna turn it up and let it cool down. That's it for today. Ha <laughs> ha! First test. We're gonna continue from uh, where we crashed yesterday. The audio went out and uh, some of the connection failed, so we're going to try it again today. So hopefully we need only one, one of these connections, and this will power this. Now let's see where I got it wrong yesterday. <coughs> uh, it's on, and I want to go into the menu and see if this week if it's taking Menu 2 shows uh, temperature and the temperature is rising. It's not rising, it's just at 23 right now. So until I set it up with the remote. So let's go to the next page. It's, uh, this is the targeted temperature 500. It wants 500 uh, temp degrees temperature before you can actually turn it on. So that's uh, set there. You could change it up, up and down. But the next page is uh, LLH, if you want this one to be your uh, um, um, host, uh, this right now is like I'm a copy. Okay, so you want it to be your host, you press down. Let me see, enter or down. And down. So now we have LNH. Okay. Let me get a closer shot. It's like LNH. So now this is now our host. Um, so now we have it as a host and let's go on to the next menu what else is there A1 so we are back to A1 so this is now our host and now we can turn this one on so this remote can control that uh, mistakenly I oh, okay so that's there we're good So now let's get this wire open. Now, we gotta get this right. We need a power cable to supply this. And then we need the DMX cable, which is this one. So one for power, one for DMX control. So um, where I made the mistake yesterday was, 
<coughs> I powered it from here to here. Now keep the let's keep the blue color code consistent, and we'll get power in. We we'll use this blue one into power in here, and then we we'll go with the white one to power out from here. So this is powering, and we we'll go power out and twist. All right, we get the sound. So that's good. Now we just do the DMX. Um, DMX will come in from out here, I guess. We we'll take it from out here because this is the control unit. I'm going to label it one and two eventually. So probably need a marker. And and we we'll go in here. Okay, so we should be set now. Now let's get our grand, um, uh, powder, which is our the ammo for this thing. It's like gunpowder, but it's not. Um, yeah, you want to put that in here because we need to burn them up, so we don't want too much. Okay. Want to add this only when the device is still cool. All being equal, my connection will work. So I'm going to keep this a little bit away. So let's go. We turn on the power now. Turn on this. 001. A001. That's the channel. You could switch it onto any channel by moving up and down, but why not keep it at one? I choose one, okay? So turn this on. Power is here too, 001. Okay? So let's check the menu and see that uh, this one is like a copy, the initial what, what we saw there. Here again, we see the temperature. We see the targeted temperature, 500. And then we see L, L, H. So which is like this is ready to be a copy, a clone, and we are good with that. Okay. I think it's gonna work out now. A tip, this bag, so you wanna keep them in a fairly warm place. Um, I kept them in my garage and a lot of them got solid like uh, uh, cement. And it's gonna be hard to use. I'm still trying to figure out how to work. This was the last at the bottom, and it wasn't exactly frozen yet. So um, I'm gonna think of how to like smash, smash um, the other ones so that they can go, get back to the sandy state. Um, this one is still is the only one that still works. So I'm going to have to work on that I'll let you know if you have any tips on that you let me know uh, I ho hopefully it's not to be thrown away it's not useless now because I got about 10 bags of those okay so we are 300 and something now all right we have 558 here 500 and uh, so the lights are blinking and I think we are good steady see the lights are steady it's, this one is still blinking. The yellow light is solid now. So anytime from now, we can go. B is the one to power up. A gets it heated. A gets it heated. B gets it uh, to shoot. B, C and D gets it to shoot. But they are different levels. So hopefully we can test all levels. So let's go. Ready?
going down. I think, I think, at the end of the day, you need to clean up the little drops of um, uh, particles, whatever these are. Minute, but you want to clean up after that. So, probably want to have a, a vacuum cleaner. Okay, we are 500 plus now, so we are good to go. Ready for B? Push the button C. And five, four, three, two, one. Boom. Okay. So I want to go to. I want to stop. I stop it with B again. I want to go to C and see how high C can go. So C is higher. Okay. See, it burns a little bit. So let's see again. See, it burns a little bit. Oh, this is already gone. So let's put this up. Just little dots. Those residues that comes out. That's all. No problem. Once again, my ammunition is finished. The heavy roll is empty. Okay. So we're good. It's empty now. That's how you want to make sure um, everything is empty before you unplug and Turn off the cool down. So now we can turn them off. When it's cool, open up and turn it upside down just in case. It doesn't burn. It doesn't burn, but you you kind of feel it. It tickles a little bit to the hands. Yeah. So for those of you who don't know, this is a new channel, and. Um, yeah, we're trying to grow this channel and uh, document my 360 journey. So, 360 photo booth journey. This is one of the accessories that's going to be, you know, rocking at the back of my platform. And um, I'm mainly going to be using it for outdoors or um, indoors where we have lots of real larger space, roofing space. Um, yeah. Otherwise, I'll keep it up simple and to add those. You will need insurance for this when you go out. So you might want to get, not just for this for your equipment, but that covers this as well. So um, so your, some of the venues will ask for that and you want to have those too. So but generally, I'll be, I'll be showing you more accessories that I use for my 360 journey. And, um, and I must comment uh, Rodriguez. David, um, he was one of the inspiration. In fact, he was the only inspiration for this channel, David. And so, shout out to David on, on your channel. I'll put a link to his channel as well. So, um, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel uh, as I document my journey. You can join me on yours um, and share your journey with me as well. Um, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.